Hey guys, this is Aubrey from Bold, and in this video I'm going to show you how to create your very first offer using the Bold Upsell app. Super easy, only takes a couple minutes, so let's get started. For starters, we're going to choose the Offers menu from the navigation bar and press Create Offer. First, we're going to give our offer a name, so I'm going to call this the Super Fidget Cube Offer. Next, we're going to choose the offer type. So we have two types of offers that we can select here. Either a cross-sell, which is where we're going to add a product that's commonly sold with that. So for example, if the customer picks out a pair of leather shoes, I might cross-sell them a bottle of cleaner for those shoes. An upsell is a little different. With an upsell, we're gonna replace the product that the customer originally chose the more expensive option. So an example of that would be uh, they pick a one pound bag of coffee and we upsell them to a two pound bag. So a cross sell is adding a product, the upsell is replacing the product. For this video, I'll show you how to do a cross sell. So after we've picked cross sell here, we'll choose when we wanna show the offer to the customer. So we can either show it when the customer presses the add to cart button. So that's when they're on the product page and they've chosen the product and they press add to cart. Or we can do it when they press the checkout button, which happens on the cart page right as soon as they're about to enter in their shipping and their billing information. The third option here requires our cashier app and it will upgrade your checkout so you can uh, do upsells after checkout or, or cross sells after checkout. This is where the customer has entered in their payment information, their shipping information, they paid for their order, and they get a last second offer at a great deal. I'll choose the add to cart button option here. The next thing we're gonna do is select trigger products. Use that button on the right and select products using the product selector. So trigger products are products that are going to trigger the offer. So uh, for example, I don't wanna offer that bottle of leather cleaner to every single person who makes a purchase from my store. I only wanna offer it to someone who's picked out the leather shoes. In this case, I'm going to choose this black fidget cube as my trigger product. Perfect, then we'll save the trigger. Next, we're gonna choose the products to offer to those customers. So I'll again enter in uh, to the product selector here. This is the product that's actually gonna show in the cross-sell offer. So I think I'm gonna offer that customer, let's go at this blue fidget cube here. So they've picked the black one, we're gonna offer them the blue one as well. We can also set a couple of conditions on that offer. So for example, we could show the offer only in a specific date range or when their cart is within a certain price range. So that could be, uh, you know, for example, any customer that buys between 50 to $100 worth of product, I want to uh, offer them a, a specific cross sell or I could even time limit that to anybody who buys on the afternoon of January 31st. I want to offer them a, a specific cross sell. So the offer title is just a, a big title that's going to go at the top of the cross sell offer that will let customers know what the offer is all about. So I'll type check this out. The offer description is going to be just giving that customer a little more information about what they're purchasing. So I'll write, check out this blue fidget cube. It is super cool. I don't know how people can say no to that. Next, we've got a couple advanced settings that we can choose as well. So we can allow the customer to select more than one of the offered products. So, um, you know, you can choose multiple offer products to go along with the, the cross sell. We could offer them a bottle of leather cleaner as well, a pair of socks that go really well with those shoes, tons of different options there. Um, we can also allow the customers to select multiple quantities of an offered product. So in that case, they could buy two or three or four bottles of leather cleaner. Uh, opening the product page, if the image or text is clicked, does exactly what it sounds like. We can turn that on or off. We can also hide products that are out of stock. So if we see that those products are back ordered on our store. We can uh, stop them from showing in the cross sell so we're not offering a customer a product that we don't have. And the last setting is to remove an offered product if, from the cart if their triggering conditions aren't met anymore. So that's only if you're using our product discount app along with uh, Bold Upsell to do a BOGO style offer. So we're gonna leave all of those blank for now. Next, we'll save the offer. 
Okay, so the offer is saved and now it's activated. Okay, so now I'm going to demo how this looks to your customers on the storefront. So you'll see if I press add to cart now, I'm on the page of the black fidget cube, which is one of my trigger products. And if I press this button, you'll see that now an offer will show up using the text and the product that I set up in my cross sell offer. So it says, check this out, check out this blue fidget cube. It is super cool. Again, don't know how anybody could possibly say no to that. But uh, if I press add to cart here, you'll see it gets added. And once I get to the cart page here, now I have both the original black fidget cube and the blue fidget cube in my cart. So that's it. That's how to create a cross sell offer using the Bold Up Sell app. If you have any questions at all or any trouble with this, be sure to reach out to our client success team. They're super committed to making sure that this app works great on your store and that you see a great boost in revenue. Their email address is support at boldcommerce.com. Again, that's support at boldcommerce.com. And you can reach out to them anytime of day via email. Thanks for watching and we'll see you soon. Bye-bye.